I remember the time when you got all excited and pumped up about an idea or an opportunity you had and you pushed yourself hard for it. But after a few days, you got bored. The same idea isn't as exciting anymore. The process isn't fun. And you feel if this is really worth your time. Then you watch someone else accomplish that and you wonder how did they do that? So the question I have today is, how are people able to motivate themselves to get what they want? And why am I not able to do it? Let's find out. Hi there, I'm Aparna, your personal coach, helping you upskill yourself to lead the life you desire. A lot of things that I share in this channel, the tips, tricks, tools, and hacks are something probably you already know. I'd like to quote Mark Hansen, who said, we live in the age of too much information and not enough transformation. When people get stuck, it's rarely because they don't know enough. It's because they lack the ability to act on what they already know. That's a fascinating quote, isn't it? And so very true. What is that ability that helps us get things done? What gives us that extra push to follow through or to do all those things that we plan for ourselves. The answer and the underlying factor that helps us succeed in whatever that we do is motivation. And motivation, like our thoughts, emotions, and even situations, is temporary. We need a daily dose of enthusiasm and energy to keep up with things. But what can we do to keep our motivation alive every single day? If you know me personally, you know that I'm an enthusiastic person. In fact, a lot of my friends call me Entukatle. Don't ask me why. But the fact is that I am an enthusiastic person most of the times. And there are certain things that I do or have adapted in my life that helps me continuously. The first and the most important thing is to practice gratitude. Nothing in my life is perfectly aligned to what my plan is. There are days when I procrastinate, I feel bored and lazy. I'm low emotionally and also feel lonely. No matter what my situation is, I realize that by being thankful for whatever things that I have in my life, I find my motivation. So an ideal trick for a daily motivation is to start your day with abundance. I am enough, I have enough, and with whatever I have, I will charge forward. Second thing is to manage my energies. When I'm low in energy, physically, mentally, and even emotionally, I know I'm low in my motivation. Swami Vivekananda said that a strong mind needs a strong body and nothing is impossible to achieve if you have a strong mind, isn't it? Making systematic efforts to take care of these energies can keep your motivation up all the time. So the trick to keep up with your energies is to start your day with exercise. Move your body in whatever way possible. Go to the gym, do yoga, take a walk, play a sport, or if nothing else works, if you like music, just dance. Dance like nobody's watching because nobody is. The third thing that I do is to visualize or use the law of attraction. Visualization is a powerful tool that can serve as a daily motivation. And you can see I have several visual aids around me. If I can just turn the camera, I have my vision board, my uh, monthly planner, which is hiding behind this quote. And this uh, find a way is my most favorite quote. Every time I get stuck in something that I really want to do, I just, just look at it and I tell myself I need to find a way, I need to find a solution to get out of this problem. Everything is figure outable, said Mary, Mary Folio. So I figure out my way, figure out my path, uh, and I am instantly motivated by looking at all these items that are there on my my screen. This is all my vision book. So an ideal trick for your daily motivation is to start your day looking at what you desire. Put your gold sheet out there and see every day what is it that you want. Print out your favorite quotes, motivational quotes that can charge you up instantly. There are so many more things that you can do for daily motivation, but I'll stop at these three because these are completely in your control. There is no dependency on anybody else for you to start using these three things in your life. Let me sum it all up. Here's an action plan that you can follow right away. Number one, start your day with abundance. Tell yourself this statement, I am enough, I have enough, and with what I have, I will charge forward. Number two, 
do start your day with exercise stimulate those chemicals in your body for the feeling of exhilaration and i'll talk more on this when i come back next week number 3 Start your day by looking at what you desire. Keep your dream visually alive by creating a vision board and seeing it every single day. I'd like to conclude today with this quote. Do not wait. The time will never be just right. Start where you stand and work with whatever tools you may have at your command. And better tools will be found as you go along. I hope you find this information useful. Do you have something that keeps your motivation up all the time? Would you like to share? I would love to hear from you. Do leave a note in the comment section below or reach out to me in any of the social media platforms that I'm on. Thank you so very much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful time. I'll see you next week. Bye. If you like this video, do give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Subscribe and also hit a bell button so you'll never miss an update from me.